All right, welcome back. This is Dr. Monty with Geek Rehab. Glad you could join us. I've got a new uh, product to review with you. This is a new TENS unit that's out, and I uh, wanted to do an open box reveal for you. So just in the beginning, it talks about on the side, it's a three-in-one TENS unit, meaning it's got for pain modulation, it's got an EMS, or electric muscle stimulation, as well as a massage components. We'll go through all of those. Uh, it comes with 24 different modes or settings that you can choose from and 30 different intensity levels. So let's check it out. So you open it, you automatically are already happy about it because look at that smiley face. I mean, come on. Now, so far I'm very impressed. It's got a great carrying case. This is good to travel with. You don't, you have everything in, in compact in one area. You don't have uh, leads and wires and stuff. Uh, your stickies all over the place, so I like this. All right, so we open her up. We got the the leads here. Here's the main unit. Okay, that's nice and compact. So you can just slide that right in your pocket as you need it. And then, uh, all right, so this is cool. So you got different stimulating patches. It looks like eight uh, small square ones, all in a little Ziploc container. And then you got some others over here for larger parts of your body, two, four, six, uh, no, two, four uh, larger pads, maybe for low back, thigh, some larger areas that need some uh, help. And you got a pad that you can stick these to so they retain their uh, adhesiveness. And then we've got, oh, look at that, we got another one. All right, you can stick more pads to that. It's really important, the length, the length of the life of the pad makes a huge difference. Once you lose that adhesiveness, you really can't use the unit until you get more pads. So these, uh, these little guys that you stick these to will help them keep them clean and last longer. And you got an instruction manual to how to use it. So let's go over uh, the unit and we'll turn it on and hook it up and see how it feels. Okay, so I'm going to turn the unit on with the power button on the side there. It automatically comes up with, you've got six different uh, modes that you can choose from, six, six different types of uh, electrical stimulation. The top four are for TENS or transcutaneous electrical nerve stimulation. Those are particularly for pain modulation. It helps to stimulate the nervous system to block the pain to the brain. And then the bottom left one is for EMS. Right there, that's electrical muscle um, or motor stimulation. That actually helps to contract the muscles uh, to help uh, reduce atrophy or, and weakness. And I'll go over some uh, examples of how I would use that. In this bottom right example or mode is for massage. And then on each side, you have a button for plus and minus to increase the uh, intensity. See, as the bar goes up, you'll get higher intensities of the stimulation. You've got that on the, the uh, pads on the A side, and then you've got pads on the B side right there, and another stimulation or intensity level on this side. So as you go through each, let me bring that back down for you. So right now it says P24. It's on the 24th uh, mode under the massage. So if I push this P plus, it goes up here to the first mode, first option in the tens box. And you can keep pushing that and it goes to the second, third, fourth, fifth, and so on as you go through every single mode. And you go backwards if you want just by pushing the P minus. There's also a timer on the bottom, and that's the duration that it will remain on. Right now it automatically comes on at 20 minutes, so after you set it, it will lock itself into place. And uh, so if you accidentally hit a button, it won't change anything. Um, you won't accidentally sit on it and increase the intensity and shock yourself uh, further. But you can change that timer by pushing the timer button. It goes up. 40, 50, 60, all the way up to 90 minutes. 
and then it goes to constant minutes. So it'll, it won't shut off. And if you want to keep going, you can go start it all the way down to 10 minutes. So if you just want to have a, diff have a comfortable time going to sleep, if pain keeps you awake and has, gives you a trouble falling asleep, you can put it on a timer, fall asleep with it on, and it will automatically go off in 10 minutes, 20 minutes, whatever you set it for. Or if you want to wear it throughout the day and you don't want to um, have to keep turning it off and on and on and off, you go through and you set it for constant. So there's, it's a good safety parameter and it's a, a nice um, setting to be able to have that control over. So we'll set that up and give you some examples of use on a model here in just a moment.